so happy to be here with you. You kind of helped me get on board. Really? <laughs> well, yeah, you guys were tweeting me and I said I better oh. do this. There you go, Stu Crew. You know, we have some power. I am here with the lovely and talented Miss Sonia Tremont Morgan, who you know from The Real Housewives of New York on Bravo TV. I'm going to pay my debt and I'm going to sue my ex's ass. We are enjoying Dogs for the Deaf, uh, which is an awesome, fantastic charity that basically rescues dogs, helps people, and changes lives. Have you been involved with Dogs for the Deaf for a while, or is this your first event? My first time, they approached me. Anyone that knows me knows I'm a great supporter of animals and animal charities. I work with the ASBCA, Humane Society, by the way, and now I'm getting more involved with some of the smaller groups and smaller charities because I feel it so much more, and everybody lets me know exactly where the money goes. I like how you giving back with this, which is a very good, well, good. Is a very good uh, example for others to follow. Well, it's a selfish thing, because it feels so good. I sleep better at night knowing I'm helping others, and it keeps me grounded. This is a fast city, and I have some fast friends around me, so it keeps me in touch with what's real. Me too. That's why I'm here. As you guys all know, uh, you know, Midnight is my little partner in crime, and, uh, you know, she wants me to support anything with dogs for the deaf. <laughs> now, Sonia, you're a dog owner yourself, right? Yes, I have two dogs. I have several dogs, actually. And I I have a rescue kitty. That's awesome. And we now have a mini hamster. It just goes on and on. I feel like Dr. Doolittle. You're a fucking piece of work. Jesus. What would you advise people with a dream to do? What's your one like tip for success? Well, one of the reasons I moved to New York and something that I stand for is be yourself. This is a city of tolerance and what I love is being myself and people taking me for the way I am. And certainly on the show I get to do that and I get to show everybody out there that it's okay. <laughs> When you become successful and also when you start appearing on TV, a lot of times these little wastes of skin and hair start coming out of the woodwork and of course they're called haters. <laughs> so how do you deal with haters and especially cyber bullies that a lot of people in the audience may be facing? The way I look at it, uh, people when they're upset or unhappy, they want to look at TV to relax. So I figure people that are looking at the show and then they tweet uh, hateful comments, I have to rise above it and understand that they're in a sad place and less fortunate than myself. So. If they feel better for five seconds making fun of my shoes or my lifestyle, <laughs> then that's great. That's one of the reasons to be on TV. You know what, Sonia? They hate you because they ain't you. <laughs> well, I have to tell you, sometimes I've reached out to people that have said hateful things, and they flip like that. They really do. Uh, they're hurting inside, and when they see that you're just a real person and you understand their feelings, it's inspiring and it helps them. May West said, I'd rather be looked over than overlooked, and I have to say, that's worked for me pretty well. Sonia Tremont Morgan, watch her on Real Housewives of New York on Bravo TV. Hi, this is Aviva Drescher from Real Housewives of New York. You're watching New Media Stew with JB. Congratulations.